Welcome back to Move with Nicole. Today's class is a full body express Pilates workout, perfect for when you're short on time. So when you're ready to get started, roll out your mat and let's begin. Let's start our class today standing. So come on up and stand at the back of your mat with your feet hip distance apart. Draw your navel in, then inhale, reach your arms up to the sky. Exhale, release your arms down, tuck your chin in and roll yourself down over your legs. Inhale at the bottom, then exhale, roll back up vertebra by vertebra. And again, inhale, reach your arms up. Exhale, release, tuck your chin in and roll down keeping a soft bend through your knees. Inhale at the bottom, then exhale, roll up. Take one more big inhale, reach your arms up, then exhale, roll yourself down. This time, let's walk our hands forward and come down onto our knees. Untuck your toes, inhale, arch your spine, roll your shoulders back, then exhale, round and gaze towards your navel. Three more. Inhale as you arch, exhale as you round. Moving with your breath here, inhale and exhale. One more. Beautiful. Find a neutral spine now and step your feet back into a plank position and then press back to downward facing dog. Let's pedal our heels, alternate bending our knees, just to warm up the back of our legs. Really try to lengthen through your spine here and push the floor away from you with your hands. Just two more. Well done. Press both heels down into the mat now and ripple forward into your high plank position with your shoulders over your wrists. On your inhale, bend your knees, press back, then exhale, shift forward to plank. Inhale as you push back, exhale as you shift forward. This is a great way to warm up our entire body. Make sure that you're drawing your navel in and that you're dropping your ribs down to your hips as you shift forward into plank. Last one. Now hold in your plank and just alternate tapping one knee at a time down to the floor. You tap and tap. Nice inhale and exhale. Keep drawing your navel in. Just eight more. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Press back to downward facing dog. Walk your hands back to your feet and roll up to standing. Let's work our inner thighs now. So come into a wide second position with your toes turned out, bend your knees and really draw your navel in. Let's start by lifting our right heel, lower then our left and lower. Six more like this. Make sure that your shoulders are stacked over your hips and you're keeping your spine nice and straight. Two more, and last one. Let's now extend our legs and bend. Exhale as you extend, inhale as you plie down. Six more. Really try to keep your spine nice and straight. You're using the strength of your inner thighs here. Two more. And on this last one, hold low in your plie. Inhale, lift both heels, exhale, lower. Inhale, lift, exhale, lower. Bit of a balance challenge here, so find a spot just in front of you to focus on. Four more, lift and lower, you can do it. Three, keep bending your knees. Last one, hold your heels high and let's take little pulses, down and down. Just eight more. Seven, you've got it. Six, keep your focus. Five, four, three, two, and one. Now hold your heels high. Drop your left heel, lift, then your right heel, and lift. So lower your left, 
lift, lower your right and lift. Just four more, three, two and one. Now lower both heels, reach your arms up to the sky and take a little pulses down and down. Really bend your knees a little bit more, lengthen through your spine. Just six more, five, four, three, two, and one. Excellent job. Press yourself up. Return to the back end of your mat. Take a nice big inhale and exhale, roll down. Walk your hands forward, returning to your hands and your knees. And let's move into our glute section of class. So flex your left foot and really draw your navel in. Exhale, press your foot up, inhale, lower. Exhale, press back, inhale, lower. Six more like this, really squeezing the base of your left glute as you press your foot up to the sky. Three more, make sure that you're drawing your navel in, two, and a one. Hold the press, extend your legs straight and point your toe. Tap to the left, lift, then tap to the right and lift. Just six more of these rainbow legs. Really lengthen through your leg, four more, three, two, and a one. Now hold your toes to the left corner of your mat. Exhale, lift up, inhale, lower. Exhale, lift, inhale, lower. So making sure you're keeping that leg out at the diagonal. That way we're really getting into the outside of our left glute. Just three more, two, and one. Hold the leg lifted, pull your knee forward in line with your hip, lower the knee, lift and then extend it back. So exhale, pull forward, inhale, lower, exhale, lift and inhale, extend back. Six more like this. Keep drawing your navel in and make sure that your chest is parallel to the floor. You're doing really well. You should start feeling a nice little burn in that left glute. Really open that knee out nice and wide. You've only got one more. And on this last one, hold your leg extended back, flex your foot and take pulses up and up. Make sure that leg is still out on the diagonal. Lift and lift. Just eight more, seven, Six, really squeeze your glute. Five, four, three, two, and one. Well done. Lower your leg down, tuck your toes under, and press back to downward facing dog. Then walk your hands to your feet and roll up to standing. Keeping your feet hip distance apart, take your hands to prayer, and then squat down, step out to the left, step back into parallel, and then lift up. So squat down, step to the right, step in and press up. Six more like this. Really try to send your glutes far behind you, weight into your heels, but keeping your spine nice and long with your navel drawing in. Really good job. Let's do two more like this. Maybe sit down a little bit lower if you can. And last one. Well done, take a nice big inhale, reach your arms up and exhale, roll down. Walk your hands forward and lower your knees. Let's repeat that same exercise with our right leg now. So flex your right foot, draw your navel in, exhale, press up, inhale, lower. Exhale, press, inhale, lower. Six more. Now really squeezing into the base of our right glute. Three more, exhale, press, inhale, lower. And last one, hold the leg lifted, extend your leg, point your toes and tap your toes to the right, lift and then the left and lift. Inhale as you tap, exhale as you lift. Just four more. Three, keep your core nice and tight. Two, 
and a one. Hold your toes over to the right, exhale, lift, inhale, lower. Exhale, lift, inhale, lower. Six more. Keeping your leg out at the diagonal, but make sure that your chest is still parallel to the floor. Two more. And on this last one, hold your leg lifted. Exhale, pull the knee forward, inhale, lower. Exhale, lift, inhale, extend back. Pull forward, lower, lift, extend back. Six more. As you slide that knee forward, make sure you keep it nice and lifted, really working the outside of your right glute. Keep breathing, you can do it. Make sure that your navel is drawing in and that you're keeping your neck nice and in line with your spine. And last one. Now hold your leg extended, flex your foot and finish with pulses. You lift up and up. Nice exhale and exhale. Make sure the leg is at the diagonal. You can do it. Only eight more and seven, six, five, little higher, four, three, two, and a one. Excellent job. Lower your knee and press back into a child's pose just for one deep breath in and deep breath out. Beautiful. Roll up to seated, come onto your glutes and let's make our way down onto our back and let's get ready for our Pilates ab series of five. So hug your knees in and lift your head and shoulders. Hold on to your left knee and extend your right leg. Pull the knee in two times. Exhale, exhale, inhale, switch. Exhale, exhale, inhale, switch. Six more. And five. Really trying to be nice and lifted through your head and your shoulders. Two more, then we have our double leg stretch. Well done. Hug both knees in. Inhale, extend your arms and your legs out. Exhale, hug them in. Inhale, extend. Exhale, hug in. Six more. Keep drawing your ribs down towards your hips, making sure that your lower back stays in contact with the floor. Three more. Inhale, extend. Exhale, pull in. Inhale and exhale. Last one. Beautiful. Now time for our straight leg stretch. So hold on to your left leg, extend your right leg out, pull it in two times, exhale, exhale, inhale, switch. Exhale, exhale, inhale, switch. Really good job, keep breathing. Just two more. And last one. Take your hands behind your head, extend both legs up to the sky and turn your toes out. On your inhale, lower both legs straight down and exhale, lift them up. Inhale, lower, exhale, lift. Just six more. We've only got one more exercise after this to complete our Pilates ab series of five. You can do it. Two more. Inhale, lower, exhale, lift. Last one. And now let's finish with our crisscross. Twist to the left and then to the right. Nice exhale and exhale. Really trying to draw your elbows to your knees. We've got eight more and seven. Can you twist over a little bit more? Five, four, three, two, and one. Well done, rest your head, hug your knees in. You should have felt the fire on that one. Let's now roll on to the front side of our body. Make sure your feet are hip distance apart, stack your hands on top of one another and rest your forehead on your hands. Really draw your navel in and on your inhale, roll your shoulders back, lift your chest off the floor, exhale, lower. Inhale, lift. Exhale, lower. Keeping your forehead rested on your hands. We're really working our upper body here and our back muscles to lift our chest up. Just three more. Two. 
and a one. Hold your chest lifted, reach your arms back with your palms facing down, and then lift your legs off the floor. Let's kick our legs. You switch and switch. Really roll your shoulders back, keep drawing your navel in. Just eight more, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and a one. Excellent job. Okay, final series of class. Take your hands underneath your shoulders, push yourself up to a push-up position and tuck your toes under. On your inhale, bend your elbows, exhale, press up, then lift your knees, open into a side plank and then return to your push-up. Inhale, bend, exhale, press, open to the other side and then return to your push-up. Keep going, you've got six more like this. Inhale, bend, exhale, press. Inhale, open, exhale, lower your knees. Four more. Keep drawing your navel in. You're doing really well. Two more to go. Keep your focus and keep your energy levels up. Last one. Now hold in your plank to finish and let's pull our knees across our chest. You pull and pull. So bringing your knees to the opposite elbow. You've got it. Only eight more. Seven, this is it. Six, five, four, three, two, and one. Excellent job. Lower your knees and press back into a well-deserved child's pose. Then roll your chest up. Take a nice inhale, reach your arms up to the sky and exhale, interlace your hands behind your back. Inhale, open through your heart, straighten your arms, feeling a beautiful stretch for your shoulders and opening through the front body. Then carefully release your hands and let's come to a seated position. Bring the soles of your feet together with your knees apart. Inhale, lengthen your spine and exhale, fold forward. Feeling a beautiful release for your hip flexors and for your glutes. Then carefully lift your chest, cross your legs, Inhale, reach your right arm up and exhale, side bend to the left. Other side, inhale, reach your left arm up and exhale, side bend to the right. Then return through center and let's finish class like always with one last big inhale, reach your arms up and exhale, lower your hands to your heart. Thank you so much. I hope you enjoyed today's fast paced class. Don't worry if it takes you a few times to get used to the class, it will get easier and easier the more you do it. If you wanna see more videos like this, don't forget to leave me a comment, like this video and subscribe to my channel. Thank you so much and have the most amazing day.